Holy Spirit. You're the comforter and counselor. Strengthen us, Holy Spirit. Take complete control. Oh, purify us, Holy Spirit. Take complete control. My dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus. In the letter of St. James, chapter 2, he is speaking a very beautiful thing about the crown of life. So today I would like to speak about it. Crown of life. Who receives the crown of life? So let us listen to the word of God. James chapter 1. Verse 12. Blessed is anyone who endures temptation. Such a one has stood the test and will receive the crown of life that the Lord has promised to those who love him. The Lord wants to give each one of us a crown of life. Sometimes the Lord wants to give us this crown of life every single day. That's why St. Faustina said, I start my day with the temptation and ends the day with another temptation. <laughs> that means the Holy Spirit gives her this crown of life every day. She overcomes the temptation with the power of the Holy Spirit so she received this crown of life. My dear friend, the Lord Christ Jesus is inviting you to receive this crown. That's why he allows temptations. Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. St. Augustine says, I will read for, for you. Someone who is not tempted is not tested. Someone who is not tested makes no progress. So in our spiritual life, when temptations come, when trials come, remember that the Lord wants to give you a crown of life. Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the, the Lord. Lord. That's why St. James says, blessed is anyone who endures temptation. Such a one has stood the test and will receive the crown of life that the Lord has promised to those who love him. So, we will be able to overcome the temptation only when we love the Lord. Only when we are able to love our Lord, we will get this spiritual strength to overcome the temptations. Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So, it is an expression of our love towards God. When temptations come, we express our love towards God and we resist the devil. Then what happens? The devil flees away from us and Jesus Christ is coming and he will put the crown of life in our head. Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. And St. Paul, in his first letter, chapter 10, verse 13, so he gives a strong assurance to really has touched my heart. This word of God is very powerful, very positive. It always gives me strength. First Corinthians chapter 10 verse 13. No testing has overtaken you that is not common to everyone. God is faithful and he will not let you be tested beyond your strength. But with the testing, he will also provide the way out so that you may be able to endure it. No testing has overtaken you that is not common to everyone. So sometimes we may think that, oh, I have all these temptations. Only I have these trials. Only the Lord is testing me. No. The Bible says, 1 Peter chapter 5, verse 9. Resist him, steadfast in your faith. For you know that your brothers and sisters in all the world are undergoing 
the same kinds of suffering so st peter says that not only you but all the brothers and sisters all over the world are facing the same trials many of them have same suffering the satan is attacking many of them so don't think that not only you are you alone are suffering no and st paul says god is faithful he will never let us have more temptations or trials that we can't overcome so the lord is there to comfort us to strengthen us praise the lord praise, praise the, the lord. lord that's why in the book of imitation of christ the author says no temptations no victory no labor no rest so if you have temptations then only we will have victory then only we can experience this crown of life praise the lord praise, praise the lord. lord hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus thank, thank you jesus. jesus praise you jesus praise you jesus we know when jesus started his public ministry the spirit led him to the wilderness to be tested by the satan and satan came and tested jesus gave him temptations and jesus could overcome the temptation using the word of god then what happens when jesus overcame the temptations jesus received supernatural power so whenever we resist the devil we get more power from the holy spirit so when we get more power from the holy spirit we will be able to resist the devil praise the lord praise the lord james chapter 4 verse 7 submit yourselves to god resist the devil and he will flee from you so james says resist the devil and he will flee from you so when the devil comes with the temptations we have to resist him resist him resist him no compromise praise the lord praise, praise the lord. lord hallelujah 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 i remember a university student and his name is justin he is doing his, his masters in birmingham uk so one day during the time of a, a spiritual conference he gave his testimony and at the age of 16 or 17 he fell into uh, pornographic addiction then he he really was in sin he couldn't get out of it for many years he was in this sin and he was really shattered and his parents are strong catholics who pray every day and there came a time that he was not able to recite the lord's prayer he said such a terrible situation then his parents sent him to india and he is originally from india kerala he went for a residential retreat and when he heard the word of god he really received the holy spirit and a priest laid his hands on him and said a small deliverance prayer and he says during that time he got a complete healing and deliverance and now for 5 years now no pornography no masturbation is completely healed but even now when temptations come he has this power of the holy spirit and he really resists the devil and he says so when the temptations come he is happy because when temptations come he has the spirit of god and he resists the devil and the res- the devil uh, go away from him then the lord gives him the crown of life praise the lord praise, praise the lord. lord my dear brother and sister when you listen to the word of god you might have failed many times when the satan attacked you when the temptations came now today today is the day of salvation now ask our lord jesus christ to give his spirit the spirit of resistance you can resist the devil so that you will be able to overcome the temptations please close your eyes please close your eyes and pray pray earnestly lord jesus i thank you for all the temptations lord even i thank you for the times i have failed so i cling on to you oh lord lord i need you i need you more and more lord i need your power 
Lord Jesus, I understand whenever temptations come, if I endure them, I receive the crown of life. Lord, I need this crown of life in my life. Jesus, Jesus, send forth your spirit. I need your spirit so that I can resist the temptations. I can resist the devil. Come, Lord Jesus. Oh, Holy Spirit. Help me, Holy Spirit. You are the helper. Help me, Holy Spirit, to resist the temptations. Hallelujah. 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 Holy Spirit. to thy precious love. Holy Spirit. Prepare me for the day. Help me, Holy Spirit. The great glorious day. Holy Spirit. When my Lord comes back to take me home. Oh, precious Spirit. Precious Spirit, come. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, come. Holy Spirit. Come into me now to touch and heal. Oh, precious Spirit. Precious Spirit, come. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, come. Holy Spirit. Come now and set my life on fire. Oh, let my heart burn with love, with love for my Lord. Let thy mighty power flow and set me free. Holy Spirit. Let my heart burn with love, with love for my Lord. Holy Spirit. Let thy mighty power flow and set me free. Precious Spirit, come, Holy Spirit, come, come to me now to touch and heal. Precious Spirit, come, Holy Spirit, come, come and now and set my life on fire. Holy Spirit, thank you, Holy Spirit. When you endure the temptations, Lord Jesus Christ will give you the crown of life. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. In the presence of our Lord Jesus Christ. Let us surrender all our trials and also all the temptations. Lord Jesus, we are, we are here. We are here with all our shortcomings. Many times we have failed when temptations came. We are asking you are pardoned and seek your mercy, O Lord. Jesus, now we are here to give you honor and glory. Lord Jesus, you are always faithful. Even though we were faithless, you were always faithful. Lord Jesus, now we offer our lives to you, Lord. Jesus, we praise you, Jesus. We glorify your name, Jesus. Jesus. We thank you, Jesus. Jesus. We worship you, Jesus. Jesus. We adore you, Jesus. Jesus. Oh, we glorify your name, Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise we you, Jesus. We worship and adore you. Christ our King. Christ our King. Jesus. 
Now we receive his blessing and we receive his anointing. Lord Jesus, bless us, O Lord. Anoint us, O Lord. Give us your power. We need your power. We need your strength, Lord. We need your strength so that we can overcome all temptations. Hallelujah. 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 Anoint your people. Touch your people. Deliver your people. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you. 